Hi, everyone. Welcome to Junior Peacemakers at Home. Today, we are going to be talking about justice and the difference between justice and equality. So, I'm going to start by showing my slideshow in which I have made. Okay. So at first it starts with this little picture of four little kids and they're holding this banner here and it says justice on it. Okay, so the first thing we're going to go over is this picture which, which shows the difference between equality and justice. Now, there is a very, very big difference between equality and justice. Equality, as you can see here in this example picture, is when everything is the same. We want, but in this case, the objective, which means what we're trying to do, is to look over this fence so we can see that game over there. As you can see, this person is really tall and they obviously don't even need this one block, this one box to see above the fence. This other person, the middle person, looks like one box would be just enough for him. And then there's this person on the far right, which is very small. This person obviously needs more than one box to be able to look over the fence. Now this is equality because everyone has one box. But in this case, we don't want equality. We want justice instead. Because in this case, what in, in the picture on the right, justice would be so that they could all see over the fence in which that's what their objective is to do. This person doesn't have any boxes. This person has just one box. And then this person has two boxes. So they can all look over the fence. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to read a quote about justice. The best beloved of all things in my sight is justice. By its aid thou shalt see with thine own eyes and not through the eyes of others, and shalt know of thine own knowledge and not through the knowledge of thy neighbor. Verily justice is my gift to thee and the sign of my loving kindness. Let it set it then before thine eyes. And this quote is by Baha'u'llah. Now, here are the questions we're going to have for this week. So, we're going to look at these questions. So, the first question is, what helps you see with your own eyes instead of the eyes of others? And the second question is, what do you do if you see injustice in the world? Stand by or stand up to the person causing injustice. So, we're going to discuss the answer to the first one. So what helps you see with your own eyes rather than the eyes of others? So how you can do this is if is you don't listen to other people's rumors. And sometimes they're rumors and sometimes they're true. And that's why you have to go and see with your own eyes to see if this is true or to see if this is a rumor. So that's what that means. The next thing is, what do, you, what do you do if you see injustice in the world? Do you stand by or stand up to the person causing injustice? Now, there isn't always a person causing injustice. Sometimes it's just something that is not, that something that is not fair. Like as we saw here, this equality picture this injustice was not on purpose, but then here they did it so that they could all see over the fence. So this part is all, the second question is your choice. Do you want to stand up to the person who is causing injustice or would you stand by the person and just ignore it? And th thank you for everyone for coming and listening. I hope everyone is safe and healthy. Bye.